If you frequently use a fire stick, fire cube or fire TV, the app I want to introduce in this video is essential for you, especially if you enjoy downloading third party apps. Now this app help keeps potentially harmful files off your device and provides a one click solution to delete everything from your downloader folder. If that sounds interesting to you, let's go and take a closer look. I use my Fire Stick a lot and download various apps to test different versions and their performance on the Fire TV interface. However, I often forget to delete the installation files after finishing. As a result, I can end up with 10 to 15 files which quickly accumulate and take up valuable storage space. If you're looking for a simple way to delete all of your files from Downloader without having to remove them individually, I have the perfect solution. There's a tool called Trace Vanish that is available for download directly from the Amazon App Store. Let's install it and explore what it can do for us. To install Trace Vanish, use the search icon and type Trace Vanish using the on-screen keyboard. Then tap on Trace Vanish to install it. After installation, open the app and accept the privacy policy. Next, grant TraceVanish access to your storage by clicking Allow and then selecting Files and Media, followed by All Files. Now the options may look slightly different if you're using an older Fire Stick or Fire TV. Then press the back button on your remote to return to the TraceVanish app. Before testing what Trace Vanish can do, I will quickly check the storage space on my Fire Stick to see how much space is available. This way I can compare it after using the Trace Vanish app to determine how much space it has freed up on my device. I can return to the Fire TV home screen and open the settings to check my available storage space. Then I navigate down to my Fire TV select about and click on storage. This shows that I have 4.22 gigabytes of storage available. Now let's go back to the Trace Vanish app. The app is straightforward offering four options to clear different types of files. By selecting the option at the top labeled clean leftover app install files, you can remove all those APK files with just one click. Additionally, a report will appear at the bottom of the screen detailing what is being removed. If like me you have many files to clear, this feature saves you from having to delete them individually. With just one click you can sit back and watch the files being automatically deleted. But Trace Vanish is not just about cleaning up your device. It also provides additional security features that can clear out other residual files and potential unwanted security threats in the form of off-browser cookies and tracking logs. So even if you don't have lots of installation files to get rid of, Trace Vanish is still worth checking out because of these extra security features that can help keep your device safe. It's like having a security guard for your Fire Stick. Now that Trace Vanish has finished removing unwanted and potentially malicious files, I can go back into my storage and check its impact. I can see that my available storage has increased by almost an extra one gigabyte. However, I did have a lot of large files stored in Downloader, which likely contributed to most of the storage space being used. So if you don't have many files in the Downloader app, don't be disappointed if Trace Vanish doesn't free up a significant amount of space for you. It's still a valuable tool for removing potential security risks from your device. The Trace Vanish app is relatively new and I first shared a video about it in September of last year. Now since then, the developers have been dedicated to improving the app's ability to detect potentially malicious files. 
They're also working to ensure a more accurate distinction between files that are safe to delete and those that should be kept. This commitment to continuous improvement should give you confidence in the app's effectiveness. The developers are passionate about their work on this app and welcome any feedback you may have. So give it a try and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, comment and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases. These small actions from you make a big difference to me and help to improve how YouTube recommends my videos to potential subscribers. And I truly appreciate your help in making my channel grow.